You are watching the Food Processing Fundamental video series, High Pressure Processing. This video is brought to you by our sponsors, Hyperbaric and JBT of Your. More information on our sponsors will be provided later on. You can also find company and product information provided in the information section below. High pressure processing is a way to greatly increase the shelf life of foods and beverages without heat, which is why it's sometimes called cold pasteurization. HPP involves immersing a product in a flexible package in a tank of water that is then pressurized to as much as 87,000 pounds per square inch. This pressure literally squeezes the life out of microorganisms inside the package, rendering them unable to cause spoilage or other contamination. High pressure processing got its start in the 1990s as a way to preserve guacamole dip. It is now used on foods including juice, wet salads, soups, stews, sliced deli meats, even prepared meals. HPP can't preserve food indefinitely like canning, but it can add weeks to a product's shelf life. And it does this without preservatives and without the changes to flavor that heat treatment brings about. This not only makes food taste better, but it allows processors to appeal to consumers with an ingredient list that's clean and free of preservatives. HPP's biggest disadvantage is expense. As a batch process, it's not as efficient as continuous or semi-continuous processes like retorting or aseptic processing, so it costs more. But HPP equipment manufacturers are working to make the process more efficient with higher capacity. Equipment is available from suppliers like JPT of Ure that can process up to 70 million pounds a year. Bulk processing for liquids is also available. In 2018, Hyperbaric introduced a machine that can apply high pressure treatment to beverages before packaging. HPP also requires changes to a formulation. A product that is formulated to undergo heat treatment might have a quite different reaction to high pressure. For instance, a creamy soup that maintains its texture when retorted might congeal under pressure. The remedy might be to reduce components like starch and fat, which in most cases would be a net positive. As HPP becomes more mainstream, both processors and equipment suppliers, like the, these founding members of the Cold Pressure Council, are working to develop it as an increasingly viable alternative to thermal processing and preservatives for quality and safety. When done properly, high pressure processing is a way to create foods and beverages that not only taste great, but are safe to consume. Hyperbaric high pressure processing is the pioneer of horizontal HPP design. They have the widest throughput range for industrial HPP machines and are highly reliable with a 95% plus uptime. Their products offer customizable and automated turnkey solutions as well as an integrated configuration saving footprint. JBT of your high pressure processing has the highest possible throughput, lower maintenance costs, advanced cylinder design, and improved engineering lowering operating costs. Visit avure-hpp-foods.com to learn more.